In the new model cycle, two significant changes in the convective inhibition will be implemented. In parcel theory, K and C are computed as vertical integrals of buoyancy expressed in terms of virtual temperature difference between the lifted air parcel and its environment. Currently, in ECMWF model for computational efficiency, K and C are approximated using equivalent potential temperatures. This approximation can massively overestimate C. In practical terms, this means that the model output can suggest no chance of thunderstorms due to high scene values, while according to parcel theory, thunderstorm initiation is actually very likely. To correct this, convective inhibition in the new model cycle is using virtual potential temperatures of the parcel and the environment. This provides an estimate for scene which is much more in line with forecast practice. Please note that CAPE will not change for the time being, as this may affect adversely users and products such as the Extreme Forecast Index. Unlike the current setting, in the new model cycle, both CAPE and SIN refer to the same most unstable parcel, which improves their usability for diagnosing deep moist convection. These charts show an example of the typical difference before and after the changes. In many areas, such as Eastern Europe and France, thunderstorms look more likely to initiate due to lower values of sin. The changes described here improve the usability of convective inhibition by bringing sin values closer to those predicted by the parcel theory, which is widely used in the forecasting practice and by allowing better interpretation of CAPE and SIN when used together, as they now both refer to the same most unstable air parcel.